Welcome to Art Bites, Short Encounters with the Collection of the Mariana Kistler Beach Museum of Art. I'm Associate Curator of Education, Catherine Slodgett, and today I would like to share this piece with you. It's about eight by 12 by Jerry Finch. It's called Meadow Log Cabin. Um, Jerry Finch was born in New Jersey. She was the middle of um, eight children. Um, she went through many years of formal art training, Trenton State College, um, and then on to the Philadelphia College of Art, where she studied sculpture, bronze sculpture and life drawing, and then more studies in California. Um, her circuitous route um, eventually took her to Belfast, Maine, um, where she lives um, today. And she, um, began her work doing very, very large airbrushed paintings. Um, and you can see a picture of her in the bottom right corner um, using the airbrush. Um, the interesting thing is that in addition to doing these large airbrushes, she would then also quilt on top. And you can see in this quilt scape how she has quilted part of it and then also used some decorative embroidery. Um, these pieces were very, very large, um, 60 by 144 inches. Um, many people referred to them as murals. Um, and as uh, they were be in really corporate offices, libraries, um, places like that. Um, this was really, really hard work. And so in 2000, after doing these very technically difficult pieces, um, and then also physically difficult. She had sore shoulders and some breathing issues. She switched to more traditional painting, oil painting and acrylic paints and um, began to study advanced color theory um, with Chris Engman. In 2014, she opened a seasonal gallery, the Finch Gallery in Belfast. Um, and um, that started her sort of in a, a new cycle of painting. So she would run the gallery um, during the summers and then she would paint during the fall and the winter. And then in the spring, she would move to her wood shop where she would do her frame construction and all of her artworks have custom made frames. Um, after COVID, she did not reopen the Finch Gallery. Um, she continues to have an online gallery but she continues to take the summer off um, and, and really work with um, this um, method of painting. So now I'd like to look more carefully at our piece. Um, it's eight and a half by um, 10 by five inches. It's in sort of a shadow box type of frame. Um, Jerry told me she made this piece very early in her career. At that point in time, she was living in Iowa and she um, had been exposed to Amish quilting and also the fine art quilt movement. Um, if you look carefully, you can see that um, the painting itself, which is airbrushed, um, is surrounded by layers of cotton poplin that are also airbrushed. So all of the color in the fabric comes from the airbrushing. Um, the layers of fabric are put over um, a pillow of cotton. And um, I put a small diagram of one of the variations of the log cabin quilt, the variation that really inspired this. Um, and that is an old traditional quilting pattern. Um, you can also see if you look along the sides of the shadow box on the interior, she has used that same pattern of the quilting um, or the, the log cabin quilt to paint the interior of the shadow box. Um, color is Im very important to Jerry. And this piece is a great example of that. Um, Jerry says she paints what's around her, but her interest is really in the elements of painting, temperature, value, color, light, and subject. Um, when she gets ready to paint her oils or acrylics today, she actually uses three colors, 
Um, she chooses a warm or a cool palette, such as this one, and then adds white to those colors and all the colors are created from that. Um, and then she is very, very interested in the, the um, brush strokes themselves. And I think this comes from the switch of, of going from the airbrush to using the paintbrush. So I hope you enjoy this nice cool meadow on um, during a hot summer season and hope you will join us again for another Art Bite. Thank you so much.